Most orthodontists are, of course, dentists, and I find them more interested in dental alignment than facial appearance. Um, when I chat to them about this, they sincerely don't think that moving the teeth makes really any difference to facial appearance. Um, I originally was interested in this and I looked at a long series of profile x-rays of patients who'd been treated, some with extraction, some without. But I noticed that regardless of which treatment was carried out, the face nearly always increased in length by one, two, sometimes three millimeters. Occasionally four or five millimeters and uh, now and again much more. And this had really quite a, an unfortunate effect on the facial appearance. I think when I chat about it to, to orthodontists, they mostly feel that this only happens if the treatment isn't correctly done and they really have no sense that it's likely or that indeed they should warn patients of the risk. I did some research, as I've told you before, on identical twins, partly to discover the effect on the face. And following the treatment by different methods, I asked 10 judges to assess the facial appearance. So these judges found that every case that had been treated with orthodontics using fixed appliances looked worse after treatment. Now, some of them were only very slightly worse. What is interesting, when I was looking at the faces myself, comparing the two could hardly see any difference. But eventually I would say, well, I think that's slightly better. What surprised me is that the judges in every case agreed with me. So although the difference may be very slight, you can pick it out at once. But anyway, um, I uh, have had difficulty with this particular subject with orthodontists over many years. And I'm surprised that they themselves have done very little research into facial appearance. Most of their research has been using computer graphics to make changes to faces. But of course, this doesn't really create a realistic face. And <clears throat> when it comes to asking patients to make a judgment, um, <clears throat> they find these artificial faces quite difficult to assess. Now, with the publicity that I've had on uh, Facebook and other sites, I've had a lot of distressed parents, and I've been surprised how many there are from all over the world, saying that either their or their children's faces have been badly damaged. Um, and there is no doubt that patients are far more sensitive to this than perhaps orthodontists are. Um, unfortunately, because of this response by the public, I am now seen as a threat, a threat to orthodontists anyway. Um, and uh, they have gone to really great efforts to, in effect, keep me quiet by removing me from the register and from their membership. But I have found that the treatment is getting more and more popular overseas. And I think ultimately this will rebound on the British orthodontists who will be found at fault. Mm -hmm.